there friends, it's Coach Reggie from Urban Initiatives and welcome to your challenge of the week number seven. Hope you were able to score more goals than my two out of five. Last week really taught me about the importance of focusing on one goal and believing in myself to get better. I stayed persistent and didn't let a low score discourage me. Keep trying our challenges and let us know how you did by having an adult post your video to Facebook or Instagram and tagging Urban Initiatives when you do. Let's get started. Welcome to your agility challenge. Agility is how quickly and easily you can move your feet. So let's see if you have the happy feet that it takes to become a better soccer player. We're gonna do three different movements, 10 seconds per movement. First, let's make sure we find our space bubble so that we don't hurt ourselves on anything around us. And then let's warm up our body. So let's start by rolling out our ankles rolling it one direction and then the other direction. We can switch legs and roll out our ankles. Then we can do some high lunges. So lunging to the right, to the left, back to the right, then back to the left. Once you feel loose and warmed up, we'll get started with our first exercise, which is skaters. With skaters, you are going to slide to the left, balance, slide to the right, balance and hold. Our next exercise is gonna be shuffles. With shuffles, you're just gonna shuffle your feet back and forth, remembering to use your arms. And our last exercise is up-downs. So you're gonna quickly move your feet up and down your mat. We're gonna do those three exercises to the count of 10. Let's get started with skaters. Are your marks? Get set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And then shuffles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And then we will do up downs for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and nine, and 10. Whew. And that is the end of that challenge. Whew. That challenge definitely helped me get my heart rate up and work on my agility. This is an awesome challenge. You can practice it over and over again to help you improve your foot speed and quickness. We're always getting better. Now it's your turn to give it a try. In Coach Eugene's Empower session, we talk about how you can use time management to complete the things you need to do in order to have more time for what you want to do. You can think of exercise as an essential activity that you need to keep your body and your mind healthy and well. Along with homework and chores, make sure you find time for exercise too. All right, I'm off for more practice. Be sure to check out Coach Eugene's Empower Session on Facebook. Good luck on this week's challenge and we will see you next week, friends.